Hi guys, and thank you so much for tuning into this video. So I am doing this um, pretty um, funny clown makeup for you guys. I know this is not the best makeup out there, and please remember that I am using all Halloween pretty much makeup or my own makeup. I did not go out and spend a ton of money for this because honestly, I love Halloween and everything, but it is not worth a couple you know that much money um so yeah i did this with some halloween makeup and it's not the most professional but i feel like it's very realistic for someone who's just doing halloween makeup on themselves i have worn this look to work because i'm allowed to dress up for work and i got a lot of compliments 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 on it nonetheless so if you guys want to see how i got this it was really easy and really simple um, just keep watching and I hope you guys have an awesome Halloween So today I'm gonna be doing a talk through video because that is the best way I can figure out how to do this because if you have seen my Alice rave makeup um, Video I am not good at voiceovers and so yeah, so I'm gonna be doing my clown makeup today So I have like a little bit of eyeliner left from previously so don't get super butthurt about that so yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the tutorial. So first off, I am gonna take this right here. This is white cream makeup. You can get this at Walmart. I got this in a really awesome kit where I'm gonna be using um, pretty much all the Halloween makeup from. But you can get this at Walmart for like $2. And by Walmart, I mean Walmart. Don't go to Target. Like I love Target and everything, but Walmart knows where it's at when it comes to Halloween makeup. And I'm actually gonna mix that in with a little bit of my CoverGirl Stay Fabulous foundation because I think the starch white base looks a little creepy clownish. Very small amount of foundation. And just because this has a primer in it too, it will help um, adhere to the cream makeup to my face. I'm going to go ahead and take this and start applying it all over my face. I'm going to go ahead and take a wet sponge and just kind of blend everything out. Okay, so it says that you should let this cream makeup set for 15 minutes before you apply other makeup. I'm going to go ahead and go in with another layer, mainly over my brows because I'm going to be drawing them in differently. But just overall on my face uh, with just purely this white makeup. Okay, so it's been about 15 minutes or so, and I think my face is pretty set. So just so you guys know, I did go ahead and um, in the kit, they also gave me these little cosmetic makeup pencils. I took the white one and went over my eyebrows just to make sure it was super white. Because now we're going to be drawing in new eyebrows, and um, I'm going to be using a black eyeliner you guys can use whatever eyeliner you want if you guys um these are really important and if you guys want you guys can go really crazy funny with them i'm just gonna literally do like a really thin brow on each side because i want to come off more friendly but again if you want to come off more classic or scary clown you can definitely play up the eyebrows I'm going to be taking the blue little pencil thing out of the kit. So I'm going to be taking the blue and I'm just going to be pretty much drawing a triangle like shape or triangle, a diamond like shape around my eye. If you have a blue eyeliner, that can be um, much more useful, but I don't have one because I'm not an adventurous colorful person. So, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's there. There it is. And I'm just going to start filling it in. The kit I bought also came with this, which is pretty cool. It's like a makeup, um, like little palette of cream makeups that you can use. So I'm going to go ahead and dip into this blue here and just fill in my eye because these are much more pigmented. I'm going to be using a blue from the 252 palette, but you guys can use whatever you guys want. Now 
now that that's set, I'm going to go ahead and take that black pencil and trace over it just to kind of give it more definition. Go ahead and grab that black eyeliner again and I'm going to draw a triangle under my eye. Like that. So it's going to be kind of wide but ends up really skinny and I'm going to do the same thing right above my eyebrow. And same with here, a little bit. So now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and just line this eye and I'll come right back. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and get this red pencil here and draw kind of a circular part for my blush. And I'm not really worried about it. I'm going to go ahead and do my nose too. Having that sponge from before, I'm going to go ahead and just blend this out. Okay, for my lips, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Matte Red Lip Cream. And I'm going to be really overdrawing my lips on the top, kind of making them bigger and fuller because my natural lips are really tiny. So I'm just going to just do it and you guys can see. all over my nose. Now I'm gonna go ahead and grab a translucent powder. Any translucent powder will do. I'm using one from NYC and a big fluffy brush. I'm just gonna set everything. that's pretty much it for my clown makeup so I know it's not the best out there but I am trying really hard I'm not super like creative or into um, interesting makeups like this but yeah if you guys like this video and you guys want to see something else please let me know in the comments below I would love to try it out for you guys and I will see you guys next time if you guys do do this makeup though um, please send me pictures or tag me in Instagram my Instagram is down below and yeah Thanks so much and have a happy Halloween, guys. Bye. Okay, guys. So in light mint of my clown makeup and my giddy clown mood because I actually really like wearing this makeup to work because a lot of people get um, really happy when they see it. Sorry if you heard that like noise. I just un stopped focusing my camera. Anyways, so in the spirit of my clown makeup, I have a joke for you guys. So what did O say to Q, guys? Put that thing back in your pants. Ha 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 ha.